Good morning, Liberty family. I'm so glad you joined us on this very special day. To all of you mothers out there, happy Mother's Day. I pray that your day is filled with peace and joy. Over the last several weeks, we have been taking a look at the New Testament guidelines for giving, and we will continue discussing this over the next few weeks. Today, let's take a look at giving worshipfully. In Acts 10, Cornelius was described as devout and God-fearing and one who gave generously. An angel of the Lord appeared to him and said, your prayers and your gifts to the poor have come up as a memorial offering before God. Cornelius worshiped through giving. 2 Corinthians 8, 9 says that though he was rich, yet for your sakes he became poor so that you through his poverty might become rich. Our giving is a worshipful imitation of His giving. Matthew 5, 23 and 24 describes giving in the context of corporate worship when we are instructed to leave our offering at the altar and go reconcile before we complete our worship through giving. This act of giving is every bit a part of our worship as praying and singing to the Lord. If you are prepared to give today, you can do so by giving on our website, you can leave your gift in the offering box at the back of the sanctuary or by texting GIVE to 205-898-5545. As you give, do so with a heart of worship and know that it is an aroma that pleases the Lord. You are invited. Come join us for Barron's Baseball at Regents Field this Tuesday at 6 p.m. We'd love to see you there. Next Sunday, May 19th, we will be recognizing the graduating class of 2024. Y'all, my youngest son is graduating. So I'll be here with all the other moms and dads taking pictures and crying. So please let our church secretary know if you have a graduating senior so they can be a part of it. Family, our prayer focus this week is Sandy Brittnell and Children of Destiny. Let's be intentional in praying specifically about the progress of their vocational school in Nicaragua. Please join us today and all this week as we ask God for His blessing over this ministry as they serve orphans and build God's kingdom. So now let's focus our attention on the Word as we welcome up Pastor Bruce. 